YouTube. Hello, YouTube fam. We're, How you guys doing? We're back. We're back. This is the Mike and Tony show. This is Mike. Mike. Short for Michelangelo. And well, I'm Tony. Tony. Short for Antonius Maximus. Antonius. My parents named me after my gluteus Maximus. <laughs> I've been told that I have a nice one. He's a butt. Apparently. So he's told. Yeah. So it's a nice, kind of warm, kind of brisk. Sunday yeah. evening in March. Starting to get nippy, a bit nippy out. Happy Sunday. We're roasting marshmallows for you today. How not to roast a marshmallow. So we have this quaint campfire that we started with WD-40. Worked pretty good. Yeah. Always use WD-40 and not gasoline because gasoline has a tendency to combust. It can get dangerous. I've singed many a beard here <sighs> with the gasoline. We don't have any gasoline anyway. No, but we didn't have any gasoline or else we would have used that because it's more fun. Yeah. You gonna roast your marshmallow? Yeah, so I'm most definitely gonna roast my mallow. Have a s'more? Yeah. Yeah, I went over to my uh, parents' place today for lunch. I have a mom and a dad. Uh, one, one raised me, the other was there too. And uh, my roommate went with us too, which sucked because he spilled the beans. It was like, we're sitting there at dinner, and for some reason he thinks it's okay to list off like all the stupid shit like I do. So he's like, he leaves his underwear on the floor, he comes home drunk, he never does the dishes. <laughs> and my parents are just like, uh-huh, uh-huh. We're used to it. I just felt like a loser, I guess. So that's not happening again. He can eat with his own parents. <laughs> no, he can come tell on me anytime. I guess I'm an adult now, so it's not too bad. I just thought it was kind of like what happens in Bachelor Zone stays in Bachelor Zone. Like in Vegas and stuff. What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. Yeah. Speaking of Vegas, a couple of my buddies, we're all 29, we're turning 30. Ew. They're like, oh, we should have a dirty 30 in Las Vegas. Ow. Oh. I was like, Wendy, let's gambling. go, but she's like, no. Wendy! <laughs> so I'll probably do cocaine and get strippers. Woo! That's what you're supposed to do in Vegas. Wendy's like, Anthony, none of that. I mean, Tony. She would you're say that. You're the only one with a wife, so. That's very true. Who was saying that they should go? Uh, Tom and Todd. Oh, yeah. They're crazy. They are crazy. Party animals, man. We should have a video with them. Tom and Todd. Make, oh, a, yeah. make up do stuff. <laughs> <laughs> one's like a muscle maniac, and the other one's like a sound wizard. Pretty cool Pretty friends. Much, Pretty much, yeah. Pretty cool friends. So I learned something new today. If you ever have a cigar, and you don't have a rest for it, and you need both your hands, and if you have a beer bottle, you stick the cigar in your beer bottle. Like, so check that out, you two. Oh! I discovered that today. The little bottle, little cigar holder. You ever have a uh, coat of black? You just put it in your Pacifico bottle, like so. That's genius. So it can roast your marshmallow. You're a real Edison, you know that? That's right. That's what they call me. Yeah, it's good to have inventions like that. So some people, they like their marshmallows like toasty. Burnt. Burnt. Those carnitrogens. Huh. And some people just like them like melty and white on the inside. Yeah. I like to play around with it a bit. I like to get mine nice and toasty. And I normally, love those carnitrogens. I normally accidentally light it on fire. Then you shake it. You can see here. One time my sister lit one on fire, and as she was um, trying to blow it out, she was singing happy birthday. And really? She, uh, she burnt her bur burnt her um, mouth on the on the fire. Well, it was a marshmallow she got, yeah, or she a got candle? Too, she got too close and like burnt her mouth. She had mouth. a birthday no, marshmallow? Marsh yeah, for, she was a little kid. like She didn't know what she was doing. Was it actually her birthday? I don't know. But she was singing happy birthday, and then it caught her lip, and then she's like, uh... I guess I'm just warning you not to blow it out too close to your lips. Don't blow too much on your lips. Does that not, make sense? Yeah, it does. So another pro tip. Stale marshmallows don't roast as nice as fresh marshmallows. These are about a year old. We decided to have a little fire today, and I remember that I had some marshmallows in my pantry. They've been there for at least a year. They're still intact. It's just like sugar balls. I think they're safe to eat. They're just dry. We'll find out, won't we now? Yes. But man, I wish we had graham crackers and chocolate so we could make some moles. 
Oh wow. Some more some more what? Some more s'mores. Some more s'mores. Have you guys ever seen Sandlot? It's a classic. It's a good ass movie. I like that one. Yeah, with the dog. And James. And Earl the wimpy Jones. deer. And the wimpy deer. The great bam you know? Bambi? Bambi. The what? <laughs> the wimpy deer? Some girl. No. Some girl what? named Babe. The Colossus of Clout. The Colossus of Clout. <laughs> You've seen this movie, huh? Oh, yeah. Too many times. The second one sucked. That oh, was yeah. garbage. Different actors. Did you guys hear that they're making the new Matrix movie with Keanu Reeves? Uh-uh. I'm so stoked. That's going to be sick. Dude, those movies are awesome. Yeah, what's it going to be called? I've never seen a bad Keanu Reeves movie. That guy's sick. John Wick. There are some like B or C movies with him that I haven't seen. They probably yeah. suck. Um, Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Those are good. That's classic. Man, hey, hey, hey. I think our flame's broken. My marshmallow's taking a real long time to roast. Yeah, that's nuts. I guess that, see how that's hot what happens is. when you have stale marshmallows. Yeah. See how hot that is. I'm getting texts on my cellular telephone device. Yeah, I heard it ring. I have a buddy, and he's like, he switched over to a flip phone instead of a smartphone. He's scared, like, all the tracking and, like, all the CIA and Apple tracking his stuff, the AI. and he's, Paranoid a little? He's just sick of everybody looking at his information. Yeah, he's paranoid about it. Is that Todd? No. No. It's, um... This gentleman, then Titus Andromedus. <laughs> That's a cool name. I wish I had a cool name. It's like his that. stage name. Oh, gotcha. I think my marshmallow's about to fall off. Mine, too. <laughs> wow, that's funny. They get puffy when you it's roast like them. It's like sliding off, yeah. Oh, man, have you guys ever put a marshmallow in the microwave? Uh, if you no. have, try it with Pete's. What it's happens? amazing. They get really big. Really? Yeah. Oh... A s'more with peeps in it? Oh, I hit the log. Man, that, that'd be cool. I dirtied it. You dirtied it. Yeah, that'd be great, Anthony. We should roast some peeps sometime. Put a peep on a stick. Let's do it. Easter comes but once a year. Have some peeps for all to hear. What day is Easter this year? Um, The th third Thursday of the month. No. Check that out, YouTube. I don't know if you can see because the lighting's kind of poor. Oh man, look at that ooey gooey. Oh like man, that, that looks gooey. nice. Are you gonna eat it? <laughs> <laughs> Spit it out. Oh. You okay? I'm sorry. I think I burnt my mouth a little bit. Drink a beer. But it's holding my stogie. Oh. That's it tastes good, good though. Conundrum. That was a good mallow. I think I'm going to eat mine. Yeah, just say mine. Are they going to make another? Would you mind t uh, tossing me another mallow one? You can hear a pine going by. So maybe next video you guys will get to see Wendy. She's our camera woman. She's classy. She's very talented. Yeah. With the camera arts. The art of camera in. Yeah, she's cool. You're luck you lucked out. Pretty much. Oh man, we should have brought my Pomeranians. They love campfires. Oh and wow. Marshmallows and wieners. My dad might breed um Lucy, the black lab, and then have little puppies. Actually they're trying, so that's cool. She has a fifty fifty chance of getting pregnant, like either she'll get pregnant or she won't. <laughs> She's a horn dog, she'll get pregnant. Yeah. You know how Lucy is. She'll be mama then, so that'll be cool. No, she's always home with my legs. <laughs> I didn't even know girl dogs did that. She's into stuff. She was raised by me, so. Got some weird <laughs> tributes. Excuse my loogie. It's pretty gross. Yeah, it is. Yeah, mine's burnt now. Man, it's such a nice evening. I love this weather. I love spring. Oh. Mm. Is yours hot too? Mm-hmm. Whoa! Whoa! I wish you played Chubby Bunny! Yeah. Have you guys ever played Chubby Bunny? Where you stuff as many marshmallows in your mouth as you can one at a time with another person? <laughs> Not recommended. 
after each marshmallow, you have to say chubby bunny. But it can be dangerous. Yeah. So if you're not over the age of 18, don't play it. Because if you choke and die, I don't want to be responsible. It's almost as dangerous as Bloody Mary. I've never played that one. It's an evil game, don't play it. Oh. Oops, sorry. I hit your marshmallow. You marshmallow no, nah, it wasn't that great. <laughs> I think I'll drink a beer though. Beer's good. Oh yeah. Pacifico, it's gluten free. Pacifico. So in the Pacific they Northwest. A Pacific Ocean. A Pacific Ocean. I think so. Something like that. So over here in Washington State, we got a lot of breweries. Shout out to Pale Breaker, Pale Breaker, Woo! Single Hill, Valley Brewing. They got some of the best IPAs in the world. Yeah, but they're actually hoppy. It's a great town. Most other IPAs from other regions of the world. <laughs> Coast. But it tastes like pale ale. <clears throat> not very good. They're good, but they're not IPAs. Yeah, you really need the top cutter. Try that guy. You guys have never been to Washington State. You guys have to visit. Yeah, it's the best state in my opinion. One of the best. Top fifty. Oh yeah. We got Seattle, Washington, Spokane, Spokane, Yakima, Tri Cities, Ellensburg, Ellensburg, and then Central Washington. We're close to like Walla three Walla. different airports. It's only a four-hour drive to Vancouver Airport. We have airplanes at the airport. I'm in Vancouver City. It's a nice city. We border Canada. Canadian bacon. It's actually ordinary ham. Um, dang, it's burning. Fire burning. Dang, that's, that's a good fire there. And if you have a beard like mine, be careful coming back into the United States from Canada. They might detain you yeah. and ransack your vehicle. Did that happen to you? And hold you for hours and <laughs> ask you dumb questions. <laughs> and then if you answer a question wrong, they press a secret button underneath the table. Then it shocks you? No. <laughs> it's alerting the feds that we've got Bin Laden. Pretty much. Dang. <laughs> that was fun. So you Coming back from Vancouver, Canada, going over the border at like 1 in the morning. Took forever to get over. There's a long line. Then we got wow. detained for another two hours. Then we got back to our car and they ransacked everything and stuff. <laughs> Thrown and strewn everywhere. No. I was like, what? That's very uh, rude to treat a visitor that way. I'm not a visitor. I'm a resident of the U.S. This was coming back into the U.S. Oh, wow. I live here. I guess we're just protecting our country. <laughs> uh, I would have detained you too. Shoot. Yeah, I'll probably shave my beard the next time I go over the border crossing. Really? No. I was gonna say, I think you should try again. Maybe it's something you said, the way you acted, your demeanor. Yeah, I've been detained so many times in my life. Detained? Because of my beard. Does it Wendy detain you too? Uh, yeah. That's a different type type of uh, detonation. That's more like uh, that's a pleasant private detonation. Yeah. I don't mind that one too much. Chains and whips. Mm, yeah, sometimes. Gross. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, let's keep it PG-13 for the kiddos. Yeah, I've never been detained. I've got the white boy privileges. They're just like, oh, go ahead. Pretty much. Like, oh, no, we know him. Yeah, one time I went to Africa. I went to Kenya, Uganda, Tanzania, Congo, and Rwanda. Are those real places? Those are real countries, yeah. Whoa. They're crazy. I got detained so at the Rwandan airport. There's guys with like AK-47s. Whoa. They're trying to tell me that I had to get this vaccination. <laughs> they're going to inject you with like But they HIV. have this like dirty ass needle that they're injecting everybody oh. with. I had to give them like 50 whole dollars to not have to get this like vaccination and AIDS. Africa is a crazy like continent. Yeah, it's nuts over there. It's culture shock. That was my first time out of the U.S. All those little countries that are just like ghettos. Poor ripped off. Yeah, except for the capitals and the larger cities. Right. All corrupt as hell. Strange place. Man, this is a nice marshmallow. That looks good. I love marshmallows. What are marshmallows made out of besides sugar? Uh, glue? No. Um, food coloring? No, they're white. Oh. 
Oh. What's that stuff, Wendy, that pitted marshmallows? Gelatin. Gelatin? Oh. Yeah, I heard that stuff's pretty gross. It's like ground up fish bone and cow hoof. So, that's what it is. So just in case you guys are vegan or vegetarian, marshmallows are not vegan. Oh my. I guess. Are they vegetarian? Mm, depends. Okay. I guess the hoof technically isn't meat. It's like a fingernail. I was vegetarian for like 10 years. <laughs> Why? Why? Because I cared about the animals. I oh. didn't like eating like animal carcass. Oh. But then Wendy, that's strange. She ruined it for me. So I like to go fishing, I'd catch and release. She's like, you're hurting those fish with the hook. Just we have to eat them. them. Just kill them. Eat it. Now so I, I ate some fish, and that was a gateway meat. Is this a true story? This is a true story. So you mm. were a vegetarian, and then you started eating fish. But Wendy I've seen, tricked me. I've seen you eat burgers and things. Yeah, now. I ate all sorts of stuff now. The fish was a gateway meat. Yeah. But yeah, I love, uh, it tastes good. Do you like it now? Oh yeah, I love me some pho gras, wow. some like short ribs, Ooh. nice ribeye tomahawk steak. Huh. I like T-bones. I like T-bones too. They should call you T-bone. T-bone! Yeah. If I had to choose my favorite meal in the world, probably be a T-bone steak with some green beans and mashed potatoes. Some home cooking? Home Just cooking. like your mama makes it? Just like my mama made it. That's a solid mm. meal. Mm. My mom's a terrible cook. Yeah, mine is too. <laughs> Growing up, my parents are afraid of undercooked meat. So every <laughs> every meat they cook tastes like cardboard. Yeah, my mom never really had it undercooked the right way. So, yeah. I love her though. Yeah, your mom's a sweetie. Yep. And I'd cook with her any day. Trying to find our lighter. My cohiba went out. <laughs> yeah. When I was a little kid, me and my brother would share a room, and we'd move to this new house, and it was pretty big. It's a big old house, yellow, and me and my brother, there were like three bedrooms, kind of. It's like, all right, you guys can share like this space. There was like a uh, open, like sunroom, there was like the bedroom, and then there was like another like side little room, like a closet almost. And my brother <laughs> volunteered to just have the closet, so he looked like, I don't know, like Harry Potter, like living in this little room. <laughs> The Harry Potter like all was in the closet? Stuff. No, he was like in the cupboard under the stairs or whatever. But it's just like such a small room. Like it seemed like Was that back in Illinois? No, that was here. That was at here. the Gilbert house. Central Washington. In Central Washington when we lived there. And all my friends would come over and John would be like in my closet. I had the reign of like the whole other room. Yeah, it was strange times, but I liked it. There's a bug. Yeah, there's a lot of bugs here in Central Washington. I wish we had fireflies. You ever see a field of fireflies? Uh, not a whole field of them. I've seen fireflies. You can catch them and put them in a jar. Put you them would, on a string. You would look out at a night like this, and like every like couple feet, we just see like a little, <laughs> little light. Fireflies, lightning bugs, they'd call them. Yeah, we'd catch them and put them in a jar and have like a little light. And then they'd die. We'd let them go before they died. We were good kids. Crawdads, though, we killed those and ate them, yeah. Oh, yeah, crawdad tails. Mmm, baby. Boil them in a gumbo. Yep. With some old bay, some potatoes, corn. That's a real luau there. What do they call that? Crawdad feed? I want to go to the south and have some real gumbo. I want to go to Mardi Gras over in New Orleans. Oh yeah? I heard they have some good Cajun. I heard everybody gets drunk. Oh, that's Mardi bad. You're not, you're not supposed to get drunk. They party though. Mardi Gras? Seems like a big party. It's like party gras. Party gras. Huh. I would like to eat the food though. I'm all about that. Some po' boys. Po' boys. Shrimp and grits. Some gumbo. Jambalaya. Andouille sausage. Ribs. Oh, I'm getting kind of sleepy. Yeah, you are. 
it's been a long day for us. We've been doing a lot of videos, a lot of uh, prep work for this. Not really. I kind of. I had to chop a couple pieces of wood. Yeah, you could have seen us chop wood earlier. That was embarrassing. We'll get better. Nobody got hurt though, so that's a good thing. Yeah, the axe is damaged. Oh well. My neighbors are all nice here. I don't own, I rent. I'm not a property owner. So, should we wrap it up? Should we call this one a call this one good? We've showed you how to do a marshmallow. Let the little rugrats not get to, to bed. Do a marshmallow. All right, YouTube fam. It was a it's always a pleasure. Hope you enjoyed. We hope you guys have a great evening and tune in next time. Give our video a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Let us Put know. some comments. Let us know what you think of our videos. All right, bye. All right. Bye. All right, cheers.